Good morning and welcome back to the channel. Uh, this is part two of the changes that we've made to Bessie. Uh, quite a few people have enjoyed watching the verse edition and I've decided that there are quite a few things that we've done to Bessie our folding camper. It's a Conway Crusader that will be of help to many other folding camper users and some of them will probably even be good for caravanners and motorhomers. So hope you enjoy this video. Yes that's raining you can hear in the background. Some people have asked what we use for storage in the toilet for the toilet rolls and other items and it's just as easy as a over the door rack and a nice toilet roll holder both of which get stored in the under seat storage on the same side of the, the camper another great purchase that we made a few years back was our Halfords uh, fridge which runs off mains electric and 12 volt wheels can handles to help you pull along it's the mechanism that keeps it cold removable dividers and we use it barbecues at Christmas time keep extra things cold and of course when we're camping uh, takes all our stuff in the back of the car and then if we've got the awning up we keep it in the awning and keep extra things cold in there because the small fridge inside the Crusader only will hold so much and then if we don't use the awning it goes underneath the rear bed inside the skirt and again it can be plugged into the uh, external power point and carries on running so we've you know we've always got plenty of cold storage space it doesn't freeze but boy it keeps things cold and i should add it's a 40 litre mains 12 volt and 24 volt electric cool box. Uh, the noise level is not that excessive, but uh, yes, as I say, it does a great job. Right, now on to this piece of material. In recent weeks, there have been a few questions as to what it is and what it's used for. Well, it goes just there, it covers the wheel arch, and I'll show you how to fit it. So, thread it onto the number eight shaped tube, put it across. It normally comes supplied with the popper there but nothing on the side of the caravan or the folding camper and rather than drill I found these self-adhesive units and they make life so much easier just pop it on pop it on and there you go your wheel cover's done. Something else that's cropped up in the last few days, but keeps on appearing on the forums, is what to do with the wardrobe. Do you leave it in and use it, or take it out to increase your surface space? And in this video, I'm just gonna show you three options to keep it and how you can use it. 
Now, option one, use it as intended. Hang your clothes in it. It's got the rail already in there. Plenty of space for quite a few days worth of clothes. And room underneath, even for shoes. So as I say, that's option one. So option two for us is to put in an Ikea Stuck hanging unit, which can take clothes, some lightweight items and is a pretty good unit for us. So that's option two. And it's only attached by Velcro, so very easy to take in and out. And now option three is to put in some stackable baskets. There's still space above that you could use for hanging or even the IKEA Stuck unit could still hang and fold up a bit and then these baskets you could fill at home put in the car carry in and store in here and we think they're going to be great if we don't have the awning as we then got space for fruit fruit and veg and things like that without having it been on the counter and then if we do have the awning up, we can take these baskets out, put them into the camp kitchen unit storage area we've got. And then we're back to either option one or two for the wardrobe. So we think it's a valuable area to have, to keep, because it has so many options available to it and the way it could be used. So here's the kitchen or camping storage unit we've got that we have in our awning it's from outdoor revolution and as you can see the baskets that i showed you in the wardrobe fit in here nicely so they're multifunctional can be used in either just depends on where we're camped up and so that's the kitchen unit. I'm going to fold it down and I'll show you the, the bag once it's all folded up. And there you are, all packed up into a bag that is very easy to store. It doesn't weigh too much, so it's great for us. And what's great about these baskets is they're stackable, but they also collapse inside each other. So don't take up a lot of space really versatile.